Hi, my name is Latrice Crawford, building coordinator for the Indiana Gear Up program at Purdue Polytechnic High School. And today we'll have a discussion about personal learning styles and how you learning what your style is can be beneficial for you. Let's take a moment to reflect. Think about a time where you were in a class and you didn't get the material, you just couldn't understand it. Why do you think that was? What specifically didn't work for you? Was it the way the material was presented? Was it because you couldn't focus? These are all things that happen to all of us at some point. So what is a personal learning style? Each person learns differently. The way a person learns is described as a learning style. Learning styles are divided up into three major categories and we'll learn about those in the following slides. Our learning styles dictate our ability to learn in the classroom. Being aware of our learning style is the best way to make sure we do well in the classroom. The way you can start learning what your personal learning style is, is to take a quiz. There are a ton of quiz out on the internet free of charge for you to take advantage of. I highlighted a quiz that I use with students often that teach them about their personal learning styles. Let's talk about one of the three major categories of personal learning styles. Let's start with auditory. Well, who are auditory, auditory learners? These students prefer to listen in the classroom. Auditory learners prefer to hear instructions and then go for it. Auditory learners often don't want instructions a second time, which can sometimes lead to error. Students do their best in the classroom when they are able to simply listen. Visual. Visual learners, these students learn best from seeing and experiencing. Lectures are, are okay for these students, but only if they can take notes. Students who are visual learners learn how to complete a task best when seeing someone complete the task first. Visual learners excel in the arts. It is important that visual learners have a PowerPoint, graph, or chart for reference while they are learning. Kinesthetic learners. Kinesthetic learners need movement in order to learn. Lectures are not great for students unless they are able to stand or move about the room. These students do best when the class is fast paced and requires moving about the room. Kinesthetic learners like watching live demonstrations or be physically active in the classroom. These students have a lot of energy. So why is it important for you to know your personal learning style? Being aware of your personal learning style helps make sure you are reaching your learning potential. You figure out how to react when a class isn't suited to your learning style and ensure you're getting the most out of your post-secondary education. Some food for thought. Think about the classes you perform the best in and what separates those classes from the ones you struggle in. Take a quiz to help you discover what your learning style is and keep your learning style in mind as you go to your next class. You may be a combination of all three learning styles. That is perfectly normal. Some classes you may learn that you are more kinesthetic. Some you may learn that you are more auditory. Some you may be more visual. I can remember being way more visual and auditory when it pertained to math, which was a subject that I was not as confident in it when it came to schooling. That is the end. It was a pleasure speaking with you all today and I hope that you were able to learn something about personal learning styles and steps you should be taking towards your future and your post-secondary plans. Bye.